back. Now, with the Cook Heel board, it's not like a regular paper, so I would encourage you to, you know, when you get your first sheet, you can just pick an area of this paper, and um, you can practice with your regular pencil first, and just get used to um, what kind of textures this paper gives you, and just kind of practice from going from a light shade to a mid-grade to a mid to dark and then from the mid dark to a dark and you'll notice that the harder I press on my pencil the darker I get but I can go to one of the blackest blacks that you can get on paper with a number two pencil now with the prism color I can do the same thing I can just really kind of I'm just lightly going across the paper and then I steadily, I'm adding pressure. And you'll see that you can get really super dark with the, uh, the colored pencil. It's pretty awesome. Because the number two, just a regular lead pencil, doesn't get that black. And you'll notice you'll be able to see the differences. And then also take time to you know, practice laying, you know, if, you, if you're going to do a bottle or something, you can just kind of practice on the side and get your composition how you want it and see how the pencil reacts to the paper. And just do it really light when you're laying it out. You want to get used to just drawing lightly on the paper because once it gets down in between the grains, it, uh, it will pick up, but I just like to go lightly when I'm laying out my drawing. And that's uh, practicing on your coquille board.